Hello everyone, this is Dr. Tui. So in this video, I'd like to talk about another behavior question. How do you deal with the negative feedback? Have you had an evaluation that you thought was unfair? So for this question, uh, so actually the interviewer wants to know that how can we deal with this problem? And uh, sometimes uh, when, we are work, when we are working in the hospital, and definitely we may uh, face this kind of uh, problem and uh, uh, the things so we need to know the reason why first so we can as a, uh, we can tell the interviewer that uh, the first thing we we want to find out wh why they give us the, the negative feedback so you know, and uh, and the next if we do really don't know what's wrong with that and uh, and then the next step is uh, to communicate with the person who give us uh, negative feed feedback and in order to make sure uh, what, uh, what's wrong with us and uh, uh, how can we improve ourselves. And, uh, and then we, we can let the interviewer know that uh, if there's uh, some, if we, uh, if, uh, if it's because our problem and uh, we definitely want to learn from it, from those experienced uh, uh, doctors, uh, nurses, or our colleagues uh, in order to improve ourselves and uh, become a better doctor. And uh, if it's really unfair, I mean, for sure. And uh, it, so you think it's, uh, uh, so that the last option would be reported to the supervisor in order to, in order to, to um, in order to, so in order to, to protect ourselves. So that, that's that's the answer I can give you. So that that's a, those are the clues I can give to you to answer this question. Now I'm going to give you my answer. Okay, Dr. Uh, say if you if someone give you a negative feedback, how can you how would you handle it? Um, yeah, that's a definitely a good question. Actually, I would say that uh, uh, I personally had no any of that uh, those experience. But if uh, someone give me a negative feedback, the first thing I would think about uh, why they give me the negative feedback. I want to know the reason, what's a problem if I have ever done, and uh, I just want to know uh, how can I improve myself. And uh, and uh, on the next, I would like to communicate with that person to see, uh, to find out the reason, uh, and also try to uh, let him or her give me a, some su suggestion and how can I improve myself in order to become a better doctor? And uh, and also I want to learn from this experience as well, uh, try to avoid those problems in the future. Uh, while if the people give me the uh, negative feedback is unfair and uh, I, and, uh, and, uh, I make sure for, and I make sure for that, so I will probably report it to the supervisor in order to protect myself. Uh, which is the last option I would uh, say uh, I would choose. But uh, as I mentioned, uh, uh, the important thing is uh, I, uh, to find out the reason why it happened. So why they give negative feedback and uh, try all my best to improve myself in order to become a better doctor in the hospital and during the residency training. So, uh, that's what, so that's what I'm thinking, how to uh, handle this situation. Now you can see that in my answer, I basically covered all of the points I listed here. And so just a step-by-step -step to handle this problem. So give the interviewer, uh, a big, give the interviewer like a, like a protocol uh, of all the procedure, how will I uh, deal with this, this kind of uh, uh, situation. So that's it. I hope you will also uh, create your own answer based on, on my clues. So good luck.